I'm Sheila Brummer with Sioux Line Public Media News. The number of applicants for Iowa's new program providing state funding to pay for private schools has more than doubled estimates. The state received more than 29,000 applications. Each account will be worth about $7,600 for the next school year. State contractors are still reviewing applications, but of the students approved so far, 60% are existing private school students. The rest are looking to switch from a public school. Lawmakers budgeted $107 million for the program in the first year, but there is no limit on what the state will spend to fund the program. But there is no limit on state funding. The final cost will depend on how many students are approved and able to enroll in a private school. According to the governor's office, private schools have reported they have 9,000 open spots. Planned Parenthood officials are urging abortion rights supporters to come to the Iowa Capitol next week to speak out against abortion bans. Governor Kim Reynolds is asking lawmakers to return to Des Moines on Tuesday for a special legislative session to restrict abortion. It's not clear what law they'll pass. Planned Parenthood officials say polling has shown a growing majority of Iowans support legal abortion. A sentencing hearing is underway for the first of two Iowa teenagers who pleaded guilty to killing their high school Spanish teacher. Willard Miller and Jeremy Goodall pleaded guilty in April to the attack on Nohama Graber at a park in Fairfield in 2021. Prosecutors say the teens were angry at Graber because of a bad grade. Miller will be the first sentence. Prosecutors recommended a term of between 30 years in life in prison with the possibility of parole. For Siouxland Public Media News, I'm Sheila Brummer.